You won't miss the Treasure Trove Antique Store on University Avenue, thanks to its new mural of cartoon teacups and pastel flowers. I'm a Disney fan, so I kind of hit like a, the Disney theme. 17-year-old Mimi Gonzalez Martinez designed and painted the artwork as part of the Avenue Mural Project. When we first started painting this, people were passing by in their cars, be like, oh, nice job, and just screaming out the window, it's so pretty. The volunteer-led mural initiative aims to beautify the area that's often hit by graffiti. It has helped organize more than a dozen murals on buildings, walls, and at a school in City Heights. Gonzalez Martinez's artwork is one of two recent installations painted by youth under the mentorship of a professional artist. Well, we wanted to uh, get together with the youth since the very beginning. Avenue Mural Project co-founder Carlos Quezada says teen artists are key to the project. Gonzalez Martinez and a 14-year-old that painted dancing fruit on a restaurant aren't actually from City Heights, but Quezada says he hopes to eventually involve youth from the area that are actually tagging the community. So if we get them involved and make them feel like they own this community, then we're going to be able to have more art as opposed to cleaning up graffiti. The effort hasn't eliminated graffiti. Even some murals have been hit. That includes one painted by Quezada and co-founder Edwin Lohr that they had to recently fix. Still, Lohr says he wants to involve the youth behind that kind of vandalism and even pay them. My goal would be to hire the taggers. I mean, if, if that, that would be my, my, my ultimate goal is to get them on our side yeah. and beautify their community. In the meantime, the mural initiative is gaining momentum. Before, it was unfunded, and the co-founders largely relied on volunteer artists or reaching into their own pockets to cover costs. Now, they've raised $13,000, and artists are requesting to join the effort. Because we didn't know that was going to happen, and now that happens. We're getting requests, hey, can I do a wall, can I do a wall, can I do a wall? The biggest challenge is finding property owners to offer their walls as a canvas. But they are already working on their next mural at a local pawn shop. For Gonzalez Martinez, the experience let her live out a dream. My main goal is just to bring happiness and just like cuteness to the world. <laughs> she wants to be a freelance artist like her mentor and hopes to find an opportunity to paint another mural. Taryn Mento, KPBS News.